Today, we are going to talk about something that I think is a really great addition to anyone's camera bag and anyone that's working with content creation overall, especially if you're doing YouTube videos, vlogging, social media, you name it. And that is this, the PGYTech Mantis Pod. This is basically a, an upgrade to any existing tripod for vloggers that is out there because they basically look the same ever since Casey Neistat came up with the bendy tripod and how to use it, right? And it's gonna come in two different versions. You're gonna have the standard version and the pro version. What I have here is the pro version of this which is super lightweight because it comes in at 334 grams which basically you can't feel it when you compare it to different tripods and this fits really neatly into your pocket. So whenever you want to bring it along with you just to go out and shoot some simple stuff, it's going to be there. You can put it in your back pocket, your side pocket, wherever. It's not going to be any issues carrying this with you. And most of the tripod is actually made out of some really like high quality plastic, but also magnesium, which makes it really durable. And the grip on the tripod is from silicone. So. <laughs> it's stuck in your hands and you don't have to worry about it slipping out of your hands because it's a really tight grip and it feels good to hold as well. So I really like that it has this neat feeling to it. It's kind of a little bit soft, but also also really grippable. If the, is that it? How you say it? And because of the size of this thing, it also fits very easily into any kind of camera bag, which I like a lot because my other tripod took a really big space and was also so clunky to bring with you whenever you were like flying and people always looked because it looked weird to bring like a big gorilla pod with you. But now, super sleek, super small. It can actually hold my Sony a7 III together with Tamron camera lens without any issues whatsoever. Here, you can stand. Oh, you don't have to worry about it breaking, falling over, something like that. It is extremely sturdy. And it also comes with this quick release plate, which means that you can snap on and off your camera super quickly. It's an Arca Swiss plate, so it's going to fit with all your like peak design stuff and quick release plates that you already got as well, which is good because then you don't have to switch the different plates out. But this plate has also a really neat screw that makes it super tight so that this plate doesn't go anywhere once you put it into place. So you don't have to worry about your camera like swinging around on the tripod. And talking about the quick release, it also has this really neat ball head joint on top, which is made entirely of magnesium and it feels very, very high quality and you have this super clean locking mechanism which is super easy to unlock but also extremely easy to lock and it really makes sure that your camera is put into place whenever you lock it and then you, of course you can turn it and just adjust it like so if you just want to turn your camera and maybe adjust your fine tuning of your shot that you're getting so it's basically like a super small real tripod head with all the different functions that you want to have in a ball head. If you want to remove this, you just untighten it, but you have to press this locking mechanism right here to release it. Because if you just tighten the screws, then it's still not gonna come anywhere. So if you forget this, it's still gonna be locked. But once you press that, then you can take it off. And what you can do then is that you can take this part out and then you can press this in here and then you press this button whoop, and they have a really long extended mode if you want to show off your surrounding or something similar and even though PDY Tech is sponsoring this video I have used this as my main vlogging tripod for the last three weeks and I did bring it with me when we were shooting Rivals and it did a fantastic job of keeping up with all the different angles that I want to have all the like uh Oh, grabbing it quickly and then putting it down and then adjusting the camera like so and so far haven't actually budged and I mean like if you think that a locking me mechanism can't hold like this is pure raw 
power right there and I can even budge it. So you don't have to worry about it coming on loose when you have it locked into place. And one of my favorite functions is actually the quick tilt function that you have right here where you press this button so you can adjust it the way that you want to. So if you wanna have the camera like this, you can have it, but then if you wanna adjust it and then quickly put your camera down, then you can do that. It's gonna be super simple for you when you pick it up, angle it back, and then you have a vlogging setup again. You do have a cold shoe mount here on the side as well for if you want to put a microphone or something similar on it. And then of course you do have this extended mode with a cold shoe too, with a small lock-in mechanism that you can put down here as well so that the cold shoe isn't coming anywhere. And it also has a couple of different tripod modes for when you want to shoot different things. Of course, you have the regular tripod mode where you just set down your camera and you don't have to worry about anything else. You just want to talk to the camera. But if you want to get really close to the ground, you also have the low mode, which also means that you don't have to worry about your camera like blowing over in the wind or something similar. And then you also have the extended mode, which means that you can get the camera, 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 which means that you can get the camera, camera really far away and show off more of your surrounding. And then you also have something cool, which is the mantis mode, which means that you can basically hang the tripod with the camera off of something. Whenever you're out shooting, whenever you don't have someone to hold the camera for you, you can just hang it off a container if you want to do that and then start vlogging, record yourself, record the stuff that you want to and then you can just grab it quickly back to vlogging mode. So there is a bunch of different features with this tripod that's kind of like hidden even though it's not hidden but it looks like it's just a regular tripod. Another cool thing that you can find in the handle of this is actually this right here which is a smartphone holder. So if you're vlogging on a smartphone, bam! They have that built into the tripod for whenever you forget your camera at home and you do just want to bring your smartphone. It's basically like one of those uh, fuck, as we say in Swedish, like hidden compartments. Now that I've been using this for over three weeks, I honestly don't think I will go back to using another tripod just because the size of it, because that is the key thing for me, like size and weight. The Pro One is coming in at 334 grams with this entire setup and the ball head joint. The regular one is gonna come in at 262 grams. And the payload of the tripods is up to 2.5 kilos, which is basically enough for any kind of A7S3, A7 III, Canon R5, you name it with a microphone on it so you don't have to worry about it not being sturdy enough. I really like that it fits so well into my pocket, into my bag. Everything is just simple with this and that is what I like with it. So I would love to hear what is your thoughts about this. Do drop a comment down below. And once again, thank you PDY Tech for sponsoring this video. And I uh, really hope that you enjoyed this video and that you're interested in the Mantis pod because I highly recommend this. It's a really, really good product. So thanks so much for watching. We really hope that you are looking forward to the BTS of Rivals. And uh, if you haven't, make sure to subscribe. And I'm going to drop a link down below if you're interested in purchasing this. Give it a thumbs up. All that good stuff. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram here as well. I'm going to put like this so you can see how it looks. Uh, oh, take care. Peter from Sweden. Out!